four games of this series tonight. Game five, and I would expect nothing less. Let's go. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. And he gets in the lane to block that. And there's the save. Burden's made a big save early in the frame here, and that's really important to reset and refocus coming off that blowout loss in that playoff game. Important to really find a way to gain that confidence and composure and get a good start. And there's the save on the play. Nizhny Novgorod's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick feed to the two -off. Tonight, James, he's been at the right place at the right time with good timing, but unable to convert as it goes off the pipe numerous times. Oh, and a board rattling hit right there. Well, certainly was lined up perfectly, body on body, weight to speak. Make it a double G. A great glove save. James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out battle and out will his opponent to find the puck. Gains the zone from the right side. Look at the Savardian spinorama. Made that stop. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Huge opportunity to go ahead in this game, James, but it hits the pipe and out. Now they're chasing. My goodness, they are really starting to dial up the pressure here now. Here's it around. Look at this passing clinic they've got going. Oh, and there's a hit on the play. Rush has got the puck along the wall. Fires it. Scooped up along the wall by Volkov. Creativity flow. Well, this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. Rush has gone up by one here in the late stages of period number one. Perfect timing as we near the intermission. Oh uh, yeah, and sometimes when the offense isn't coming, you gotta stay the course and just continue to grind. And that's exactly what they did, and now they wind up with the game's first goal. Moves it quickly over to the two off. Blocked in traffic. Gets control of the puck right in front of his own end. Rush has got it in their own zone. Shoot it, shoot it. <laughs> Well, the play might come to an end for a few minutes at the end of this period, but the coaching never stops. I'm sure there'll be a few messages. <sighs> period number two set to go here. Officials moments away from dropping the puck. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. Nizhny Novgorod's had a rough start and really put themselves in some bad spots to start the game, James. And as a result, they've turned over the puck. They haven't managed it. I'm telling you, their coach is not going to be happy. Gonchar has got it in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Hammers it. Denies him again. Lee's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's tracking the puck, making save after save. It's about time his team starts working in front of him. Still lots of time left in the period. Shot! There's the double G of the game! The great glove save! Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in, so focused, when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Moves it to the middle, and he denies that great opportunity there. With possession. 
position along the wall. Moves it to Lariano. And he was ready for that save. Bowie's hauled down. Penalty on the way. Here comes the official's decision. Well, the bench doesn't like this call, James. It's untimely to say the least with that one goal lead. Now the PK unit, they gotta get out there and they gotta do a job. Nizhny Novgorod set in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. And loses possession after a solid hit. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Fires the one-timer. Tremendous reflexes as he makes the one-timer save. Moves the puck along the half wall. Shot! The save just got enough to keep it out. Fires it. Oh, an even better save. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. A great sequence by the... Hold on a second, James. There's going to be a call on this as you see the official signaling a penalty. Penalty coming up here. Well, it's tough timing to take a penalty at the end of a period. You want to make sure that you can reset and regroup. But first things first, you got to kill the penalty. The Tornadoes with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. Oh, and that is a lot of time on a five on three. You have to have a sense of urgency here, though, because if you pop one by, you still have the man advantage. Looking to make something happen along the board. Nizhny Novgorod's got the puck along the wall. Driving right to the front. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. What a save by Vernon. Grabbed along the board by Bowie. Denies him with the pad. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Gonchar's got it along the wing. Here's a shot. Score! And we are tied after that power play, Mark. Well, it's perfectly executed, and the coach has their most skilled offensive players out there for that very reason. They tied the game. This is a great power play goal, James. They have the execution in terms of their passing along the outside, and then they attack the net with a shot. You have to have net front presence and create a screen. That's exactly what they have, and they capitalize as a result. Nizhny Novgorod's equalizer comes on a lot of hard work here in period number two. The coach will be happy with this performance, the pushback, the fight to claw their way back in late in the second, and this will set them up nicely for the third. Picked up along the wall by Graham. Puts it on net, shot! And he takes it right in the logo, what a save! And there's the horn, bringing an end to period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around. <sighs> 40 minutes in the books. Big third period coming up for both teams, and we're ready to go. It has been a fantastic matchup here, back and forth the both ends of the ice. Let's see what happens in the third. The Tornadoes have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Takes the pass. Pokes it away in his own end. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Oh, he'll feel that one. Cutting to the front of the net. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. Attacking area. Sends one over. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Looks to off the crossbar. They score! And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift, and you can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. 
Yeah, he's not happy with this goal, James. It looks like he thought he was sealed to the post, but there was just enough room to let that puck slide by. Nizhny Novgorod jumped in front by one here to start this third period. Well, they're exactly where they want to be, James. They're leading this game. They're in the third period and they're owning puck possession. Now it's just being aware, managing the puck, making sure if they're in trouble high in the offensive zone, they get it deep. Take care of the puck and you'll take care of the game. Nizhny Novgorod's moving it along the wing. Here's a beat in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Here's a short pass to Volkov. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Volkov's going to play it from the back of the cage. Here's the shot. Oh, Russia's playing the win here now. They have tied it up here in the third. You said it, James. They're not sitting back. They're attacking. And this is urgency that often presents itself late in the game. You wonder why you didn't start that way. But you can certainly finish it. Puck grab by Graham. Here's an odd man rush. Here's a pass to the middle. Scores! What a finish on the play. I love the way they were able to execute on this odd man rush. James really used the ice to their advantage, manipulating their opponent, the ice that they did have. And then they were able to capitalize when the shot came their way. Nizhny Novgorod's been locked up in a dogfight all evening long, but look at this. They pushed through and found that go-ahead goal here in period number three. Well, I think they continue the scrappy dogfight. Don't get in the mindset to sit back. If you sit back and you allow entry into your zone, guess what? You're playing defense. Get on the hunt. Get on the prowl. Stay on the puck, and you'll win this game. Shot! Makes the save, but barely with that one. Takes a shot. No one for that one to get through. Bowie's going to play it against the half wall. Great read as he crouches down the block. It. Tremendous athletic stuff with the glove by Burden. And he takes the pass. Russia's got the puck against the half wall. decision to pull the goaltender here James they get the extra attacker out so you have to use the advantage to your favor and that's exactly what they do they own the puck on retrieval and they find a way to attack the net face off looming as both centers get into position and play resumes as the puck is dropped fires it on net the goalie makes an incredible stop, but typically he just invigorates his team with his scoring and his timeliness of it. And that's turned aside by Bertin. Well, we played three periods of regulation hockey and still no winner. So what do we do? We go to overtime. possession off that battle. Russia's got it along the wall. Takes that one right in the logo. And we're going to get a whistle here. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Great reach with the poke check by Graham. Here's a chance. Great save by Burden. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Taken 
Slammed by Larionov. this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level when you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game. You know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual. This is what winners are made of. And here comes the judgment from the official. The ref isn't putting the whistle away in overtime. He's going to be the hero and get the golden goal on the power play. Tight game and a critical time for the penalty-killing unit as they take to the ice in hopes of trying to kill this one off. What a time in this game to have a power play opportunity in overtime. The coaching staff has to settle their team down, make sure they're ready to go here so they can execute and capitalize. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Gaining speed through center and here they come on the attack. around the perimeter and creates motion. They want to pull the PK outside of the middle of the ice. And when they do, they hit the bumper position perfectly and they're able to hammer it home. This has really become one of the real premier party destinations in the hockey landscape. And here's a reason why. Look at the celebration here, Cheryl. And you got to love this. I mean, the fans are there for you while you're playing the game and you come back here to say thank you to them. Gotta love playoff time. Everything matters, every moment, every play. And we will see you at the next game from all of us here at EA Sports. Cheers.